Hello. How are you all doing today? Hi, Niles. All right, people are joining. This is good. This is good. <coughs> Hello. How are you? Hello. 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 Do you want to hear a story? Sure. I got to ride in an ambulance today. Why? Did you get injured? Yes, I, I twisted my back too far a couple days ago, and I, I pulled a muscle. And the thing about that is that sometimes if you don't use that muscle for a long period of time, and then you use it suddenly, it can scrunch up and be really painful. So that's what happened. I went to sleep, which, so I didn't call 911. I did call 911. And it was all like, they were like, what's your, like, what do you need? Please fire ambulance. And I was like, ambulance, please. <laughs> and they said, okay, where are what you? What kind of muscle is that? I, of the muscles on my back, the ones that help me turn like this. So this is when it hurts the most when I turn. Uh, it doesn't hurt very much right now because so that's why I'm standing also. If I sit or lie down for too long, it'll start hurting more. Just gotta keep them loose, keep on my toes. Uh, anyway, that's where I was this morning. Uh, and I'm also- Did it happen to today? Uh, it happened, I went to the hospital today. I, the injury happened a couple days ago. Mm, wait, wait, what happened? I, uh, I pulled my back. I pulled a muscle in my back. And it's just uh, fine. <laughs> will work. Be fine. My, it's no, just the audio, I can't hear. I can't hear? Um, try connecting to audio. I can't hear her. You, you may not be connected to audio. Your, uh, you may not be connected to audio. Chat, please help out with this poor soul I can't hear. Um, what happened? Oh yeah, so I just pulled a muscle in my back. I was twisting too hard and it got hurt. And I was like, huh, it'll be okay, I'll sleep it off. And then I slept and I didn't move for a full eight hours. And then I woke up and I tried to pull my pajama shirt over my head and my back was like, nope. And it just got really painful. And then I couldn't move, well, I could move. I could move my arms, I could move my legs, but I couldn't get up because it would use my back and it hurt. So I called 911 and I was like, hey, can you take me to the hospital? Because I can't take care of myself when I'm just lying on the bed. And so they helped me stand up. The paramedic gave me a hand and I stood up. And then as I was moving around, it got better. So they didn't give me any drugs. They didn't give me any, I don't have to have surgery. Everything's fine. I'll be fine. I just have to like be careful. <laughs> you called 911? I did call 911, yes. It was exciting. And the paramedics got here. They, the concierge to my building opened the door for them because, you know, emergencies and all that. And they got into my room and I was lying there. I was like, oh, hello, I can't move. And they were like, you're very calm about it. And I'm like, well, I'm not dead, so. I'm breathing. I'm I'm fine. I'm not in much pain. I just can't move. <laughs> Wait, oh, that's scary. It it was kind of scary, but like worst case scenario, I was just gonna lie there all day. So, no. Did you why fall? couldn't you move? My back hurt. Did you fall? I did not fall. This is what I do whenever my back like tenses up like that, gets really really sore. I just lay down wherever I am. I just lie down, and then uh, if I get stuck, then I call for help. And I had my phone with me. I had a whole bunch of things in reach. I had my lip balm because I was lying on my bed. I have like a yeah. counter behind my bed. You're just like when you're in your videos. Hi, I'm Betty McLaughlin. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Hi, no, the Hi, I'm Betty McLaughlin and I'm ready for anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's a oh, great persona. You know corona? The last I know. People, the last people to save us are the Care Bears. All right. Well, I look forward to their contributions. If they could come heal my back, I'd love that too. <laughs> so, uh, oh yeah, it was really funny. I like left my building on a stretcher and then put me in the ambulance. And every time the ambulance bumped, I was like, ow, my back. And then I stayed there for a while. I walked around and my back got loosened up. It stopped hurting. And then I literally walked home. They were like, okay, you can go now. So I got up. Well, I, I went out of the hospital. Home? Yeah, I walked home and it was a place I'd never been before. But I was like, huh, we're on Gerard Street. I know how to get home. So I just walked I was not there. It wasn't that far. <laughs> it was this all today? Like an emergency. Yeah, it was. It was today. I mean, That's I've so had panic attacks. So when you're inside an emergency. <laughs> well, I've had chronic pain for a long time. What is that? Um, like 
pain that happens a lot. Like right now I have a headache. I think it's because of my back. I've taken some of my headache medicine, but I don't want to take too much of it because I get headaches so frequently that sometimes I run out of medicine and then I just have to be in pain. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I just, I just, it didn't start late. It started at three. Yeah, no. Yeah. Anyway, uh, today's Friday. It's chill Friday. So uh, I don't have a whole lot planned, but I think I promised a lot of people we could do stuff. Um, yeah, you did. So. <laughs> could we do a quiz? I think we're going to do Miley's quiz. Is that what? right, Miley? No. Is it a team quiz, Miley? No. Okay, maybe. Somebody, somebody, somebody wants, so they wanted to um, I want to do a quiz. Can we look at a project? If you have a specific project you want to look at. Uh, so you just chill out? We just chill out? Yeah, we can just chill, but we can do lots of things. Uh, Al, how's your, how are your projects going? You had a couple, Al's here, right? Right, I'm right here. Yeah, you had a bunch of questions yesterday. Are they, how's that, um, how are your projects going? I actually haven't worked on my house yet. I was okay. just doing to create the food chain one. I, right. Yeah. Okay, well, that'll give me time to record a tutorial over the weekend. I have a question. Uh, what's your question? Um, can we showcase projects? Yeah, sure. If there's anyone who wants to show off their project, just share the screen. Wait, uh, oh, can I? Yeah, go for it. Um, it's a project I've been working on. Um, I haven't submitted it yet. <laughs> Maximize those creativity points. Uh, yeah, definitely does. <laughs> I combined a couple of projects to do this oh, one. That's awesome. Um, so this is my... Ah, let's refresh. Okay, so this is the low poly fire project. So I made it when you shoot and it hits, then the fire will come. <laughs> nice. I like your stones. Thank you. Wow. So, yeah. That's cool. What is it you're shooting out of the cannon? Uh, a rock. According to the Hatch image library, it's a cute rock. <laughs> Yeah, oh, the cutest of all rocks. A cute rock? What? Yeah, it's a cute How? Rock. It's it's in the cute section, like cutesy little house drawings and stuff, and apparently there's a rock in that section, so it's under the heading cute, but it's also a rock, so apparently Hatch has deemed this a cute rock. So. And then, Can you, yeah. oh, I thought it would have a face. <laughs> well, you could give it a face if you wanted. Uh, Brenda? Yes. Can you help with the project I'm working on? It's called a uh, uh, draw a car, and then I'm doing the second uh, uh, challenge. Isn't draw a car a group project? There's there's one that's not a good project. Uh, I have one. Can you remind me of, of your username? It's, oh, it's Mateus. Mateus. It's J. Let me write it down. You don't need to write it down. You know mine? What? Yeah, Gotham Quadrant. It's with Gotham K. <laughs> Wait, you have a hatch username? Yeah, my hatch username is Mateus. Yeah. I mean, Mateus J. I'm having trouble spelling it. Mine is Lily. Mine's Lily K. Okay, good for you. I'm glad you have a nice name. <laughs> MJ, can you spell your first name for me? Okay, M. Yep. P. H. I. A. Whoa, we're going to the beach to celebrate my birthday. Oh, okay, I got you. I got your uh, account. What project was it? Draw a car. Draw a car. Uh, oh, it's not, is it a group project? I don't think so. Oh, draw a car. Okay, I got you. Is uh? I mean, it's oh, just not draw a car. Can we do a quiz? But it's not about coding, though. Uh, this is coding class. I don't know if you were aware of that, but I, I, I'm pretty sure we've been doing coding all this time. So if it's not Wait, so coding, do the question. Which la which? Uh, well, I mean, you can post it in the we chat and see if anyone wants to do it. All I'm trying to do is uh, make a pyramid. Oh, make a pyramid. 
Uh, you can use a triangle. Yeah, I did it, but like for some reason it didn't work. Is it in this code right here? Like, I what have seven hundred and fifty. There's seven hundred and fifty-three plays. Amazing, MJ. Where's your code it's, for the triangle? Is it yours? Is it your quiz? Uh, I did it before, but then I deleted it. Oh, you deleted it. Okay. Well, let's add uh, it into the background. So I'm gonna grab some coordinates. I'm gonna put it like here, here, here. I'm gonna adjust those numbers. Um, and I'll say fill can be the same. You can change it if you want to. make the car driving into Area 51. <laughs> yeah, that'd be funny. Here we go, 100, 125. That'll be the first coordinate. So I'll put triangle. You didn't put the triangle and the semicolon. Yeah, I don't have a semicolon yet. And then we can go like 40, 200, and then 140, 200. And there's the triangle. Whoa. Wow, it looks nice. I need a fully white wall. Oh, one, this should be 160. I made a fully white wall. You yeah. made a fully white wall? Fully wall white Crazy. I can't believe that. Uh, is that good enough of a uh, pyramid for you, MJ? Yeah. So I'm going to delete it so you can do it on your own. Like a lot. Literally just a triangle with three points. Okay. These numbers are XY, XY, XY. So you literally just. Boop, 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 and then make a triangle out of that. <laughs> and then you can do it whatever size you want, et cetera, et cetera. Ooh, Anyone else? from Egypt. Whoa, it's an Egyptian pyramid. One of the wonders of the world. <laughs> Anyone yes? else have a project? Yeah. Pyramids I have, I have a project I want to show. Uh, I'll stop my screen sharing so you can share your screen. I have another project after, after okay. he's done with sharing his his project. Awesome. Go Andrew and then Bavli. Wait, Brenda, did you have oh, a chance to um, look at my whistle sound? Oh, no, I didn't. I was in the hospital. This, so this is my Sorry about that. <laughs> Minecraft grass block. Oh, wow. It's beautiful. Oh. It's like day and night. <laughs> yeah. I love it. That's awesome. Day and night. <laughs> yeah. Did he get that all to work? <laughs> Well, you can uh, read the code. There's the uh, fill rect. Looks like the rect is the left half, and then then fifty fill fifty on line three is the right half. Things I got see. Marks. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. That's so cool. <laughs> yeah, especially right. for the night part. Yeah. The brown okay. kind of camouflages in. <laughs> it's true. It's awesome. Well, hopefully that's All good. right. Um, I think it would be better if you made an arc for the moon. Oh, like a waning moon? I did do the yeah. arc. Yeah, yeah. It, he, used, he used an arc. Um, it's just like it looks like a whole circle instead of like a crescent moon. But like, if you guys want to imitate this project, then you can make yours a crescent moon. Oh, I have the code. Yeah. You can share it if you want to. This project um, is this? Badly, you want to share... Okay. For yours? Uh, I can see, 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 if I change it to stone, if I change, if I change the fill to gray, it will become stone. Yeah, that's true. That'd be a good way to improve the project. I'll try to do that. So, Baffle, go ahead and share your screen. Okay. So, this is the project that I wanted to show. I managed to figure out to make the the milliseconds into minutes, then not oh, yeah. then from minutes to hours, then from hours to days. You want to show us? It, then yep, change the word. I, I show it. <laughs> well, can I show my code okay, so After badly training is? Absolutely. Minute. It's going to be like badly. See, it started to count minutes. Yeah. It is 314, so that's why it says 14. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe it isn't. Soon, this <laughs> might change. Soon the clock will change. Oh, yeah, it's 15 now. Okay. Crazy. Oh. Okay. okay. Make sure what you happened? got an open quote. An open quote before the open bracket. Oh, okay. That's weird. Yeah. Uh, no. Okay. Now it's starting to count minutes. 
That's amazing. And we already saw it flip minutes. Then I can make it turn into hours. I don't think anyone tried that. <laughs> well, it's a, a part of the project holidays and dates. If you guys remember that one. Can I show mine after? Uh, Gotham's no, going next. Wait, yeah. now, it's, now it's on hours with a text of minutes. <laughs> That's kind of cool, right? Let's wait yeah. here for an hour and wait until it's <laughs> to number. Yeah, you can show us uh, when it hits four. <laughs> it's different now. Perhaps I could. <laughs> perhaps I'll change it into days. You can make it years. Seriously? Yes. Yeah. I could do it even weeks. That's what. I, that's what <laughs> I'm gonna try to do soon. Can okay, you do so centuries in half? Uh, centuries? I don't, I don't think so. I think it's just year. Mm -hmm. I think year is the maximum too. Yeah. You can right. probably do year divided by oh. one hundred. Uh, no, 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 turn. no, 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 no. Do centuries. Okay, <laughs> I'll try. I just my clock. I fixed it. Oh, it looks beautiful. Yay! Hooray! You fixed it. <laughs> so no. Clocks move on depends on the time. So the time's here. Yay, That's awesome. Fixed it. Congratulations! It is a beautiful graphic image of a clock. It looks really nice. Hey, I have a question, Miss Brenda. What's, yeah, what's up? What, it looks uh -oh. really modern. How come, I, how come I can't get a blank canvas? A answer to the because you're not in a high enough about, level. About if we could do it. I a blank canvas. Fails what level do you have to? Be? Whoa! Everybody's shouting over top of each other. What uh, level do you have to be? You have to be level ten, 10. to choose your own 10. showcase. Ten. Uh, yes. I found oh. the I found the answer to if you could do it with centuries or not. It's gonna the fail. The computer okay. does not understand what is a century yet. That's, That's correct. That's pretty sad. I you think can work we, around it though. Yeah, maybe maybe decades would work. Maybe. Oh dang, that is a lot yeah. of group projects. <laughs> What's up, Ethan? Yeah, I'll you try. know the the clock that Gotham made it really looks modern. Yeah, I agree. I think it's beautiful. It looks futuristic. It would be perfect inside like a futuristic modern place. Yeah. All right, now it's Al's turn. Can I show um, something? Right. Can I show my after? Oh, shoot, I forgot to bring it up. Um, Decades don't work either. Wait, it's not this one. I'm just going to go out. Nothing works Let's higher see. than year. Okay. Oh, shoot. <laughs> so, for my millisecond, um, there's two things I was trying to do that I need help what with. It? Wait, what yep. is it? So first, I just did the mouse click one. Yep. Yeah. Not mouse click, like uh, ma mouse X and mouse Y and stuff for the color. But then yep. I was wondering if you could teach me how I could, like, make the color change whenever, like, the hour and, like, the minute changes or something like that. You could use okay. an if statement. Oh. Yeah, so you could you have a, you could yeah. have a, a variable at the top, like when the function is called uh, right. the first time, like you could say like var minute equals or second var, and then you put it equal to the corresponding oh, function, okay. like var or var min equals the minute function, and right. then you could put an if statement and draw to say if min does not equal the minute anymore, then choose a random color and increment minute. Right. Niles wants to show his. Yes, Niles wants to show Wait, his. I heard. I got a question. In okay. The pro in the project in milliseconds, I tried having weeks, it, and it did, and it didn't do anything. Yeah, that's because it's not a function. Oh. Oh, another thing I forgot to ask. Yes. How do you make the clock? Um, so it wouldn't be like a twenty-four hour clock. Like whenever it passes the twelve. Yeah, you hour, say if if the number is greater than twelve, subtract twelve from it. That's really so cool. If it's thirteen, do thirteen minus twelve. If it's fourteen, do fourteen minus twelve. What? That's really cool. What? That's else. only for like an hour. Like I should do it. Do that three, when you do hour. that, you become so like. How do you say it? Um, I have a question now. This is really good. Hypnotized when you do that. Hypnotized, yes. Yeah, it looks it's so beautiful. hypnotizing. In the parameters of mouse bar, why did you put Q W E R T? If I don't do it, it won't work. Why? Oh, in Python. Pi it's a bug. Oh. 
That's right. You, can you put a... Oh, never mind. <laughs> All right. Is there anyone else who wants to show their projects? Yeah. It's already been 20 minutes. Okay. Who who was the name of the person who wants to show their project? Ellie. Okay, Miles? Miley. I was just making sure. I was making sure it was I you thought, and not somebody else. I thought it was Niles. Niles already showed his project. It was the yeah. basic painter. Yeah, let's go. Miley's yeah, it was Niles. Uh, and of cards. Niles like I'm being bullied right now. No cards. Right. So, I made two separate ones. It's not a secret if you show them where it is. Yeah, that's why I did to mine, because you, know, but... you need the challenge points, man. <laughs> I know, but it, sure. like, I don't care, because, like, you need to know where it is. Well, then you shouldn't call it a secret. It's not it's a, a secret. secret about it. Whatever. <laughs> okay, at least it's nice. <laughs> You're right, it's very nice. Because what if player one accidentally, totally accidentally, gets a bad deck of cards and wants to steal the player two secret button. Well, if it's a secret, then more power to them. Okay. Well, it's beautiful. It's very nice. And you did a really good job coding it. Uh, anyone else want to share their project? I have lots to share. Same. You can well, share another one if you like. Well, I'd, I have lots to choose, so I'll, I'll uh, see which one, which one suit up. Was there anything else I promised somebody that I would do that I haven't done yet? Except yeah. for, like, look at the... I'm supposed to look at the whistle sound. You said you'd look at uh, the challenges for your hand of cards. Oh, I posted a tutorial about that on YouTube. It's up now. So you can see me do the challenges. <laughs> What if you don't watch the Hatch channel? Well, then you go, don't get to know how do you do the challenges. Okay, so I got it. <laughs> then, then that seems like a f foolish decision. Can I get help from my project after Gotham, please? Sure. Here, this is Stamp Maker, which got the- Oh, it's actual stamps. <laughs> yeah, this is this is just the one that was on YouTube. Um, Somebody reviewed it, it was somebody. Wait, somebody reviewed this project? Yeah. Was it like not me? It was somebody else. Yeah, let me see. let me see. That's really funny. Hola, guacamole. How's everybody doing? I'm looking it up. Do you see it? It's wait. Let me let me share audio. Um. Oh. Is it on the, the Hatch channel? And you not remember doing that? Yeah, it's somewhere here. I think it's this one. Do you, can you hear my sound? Yeah. We can't. I can't. I can't. I think but I know what this video is because I made I it. I can't. You made it? I, I made the voice yeah. over. That's your voice? Yes. Oh. You don't recognize it? <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> We, st we still can't hear. Oh, you, okay, wait. You have to stop sharing and then reshare with computer audio. Yeah. I've, trust no. me, I've made that mistake so many times. No. Why? <laughs> <laughs> wait, share computer audio, check. No. And it's super fun to see all the variations. Check out these examples. That is your voice. It's definitely my voice. Wait, what? It's the FBI. <laughs> you did me! Yay! I did the FBI. That's Kayla right. did the, uh, Kayla put the video together. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is my Wait, project, who, who, which is who right here. Who commented FBI? Wait, uh, the can person you, named me. Wait, 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 wait. Can, can you show the video again? Yeah, play from the beginning. No, not from the, oh, okay. okay. It's only 50 seconds, yeah. Yeah. Starting is easy. Hi, guys. This is the Dream Team here. Make new friends while you learn no, that Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. Create cool projects with real code. Who coded it? Start Hello. using projects like Basic Painter that teach the basics. Then let your creativity and fun guide you. Oh, it's so laggy. What? It's Kids not? always code their own versions, and it's super fun. Oh, my goodness. Okay, one sec, one sec. So laggy. One sec. Start 
Um, are there any questions? Any... Okay, please stop interrupting. Everybody good? What did you have to say, Miley? That wasn't me. That's someone else doing that. Oh, okay. There you go. Did, did, did anyone have anything like important to say? Any comments that they wanted to make on this video? Or should we move on? I actually wanted to ask a question. Go for it. Are there like any questions on queue right now, or can I ask like after the, no, we've done the video? No, you're you're. It's your turn now. All right. I just wanted to ask a question like, how to put how to make random rectangles in a certain amount of area? Right. You can change the parameters of the random function. Yeah. What project do you want to do it in? Like. Uh, basic how I can share my screen and show you what I'm talking about. You, you can it's not it's, it's not out it's tame oh it's tame who's talking yeah you guys have similar voices thank you thank you for correcting me uh, yeah. it's the first one. Oh, first one yeah uh basic house basic house yeah so right rectangles in a random place oh cool oh wow i love it yeah, I have an idea in mind. You see, you see when stone buildings and cartoons kind of have just like random blocks on them, like showing oh, out. Oh yeah, 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 like bricks. Yeah, like bricks, exactly. Okay, so the pillars are right here. Thank you for commenting. That's very helpful. And what I can do is, yeah, the fill. You can actually take this one out, and it'll be the same because the fill applies to both of these. It keeps applying until you change it. Oh, it does. Yeah. Oh, all right. I'll put it back because it's not my code. Um, but what you could do is you could say, yeah, it, oh, this, these are the turrets up on top. Okay. So you yeah, can do I, it for, for yeah. eyes less than however many blocks you can want you to Can you use basic bricks then. for it? For this oh, project? I tried using Probably. the for loop, but, but I, learned, I learned how to do the for loop like two days ago, so I couldn't say I mastered You're it. You're only seven for loop. Okay. Uh, so for the random X location, it can be random. Uh, I'm going to comment this out for now so I can see your actual picture. So what I would do is figure out. Um, it's because you have a semicolon. Yeah, it's because I'm stupid. You can move <laughs> it from, uh, I guess you want this top corner to this bottom corner. Yeah, it's like the bye, range. Bye. Oh, bye, 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 bye. Okay. Bye. Um, so your random location for where you want your X position of the brick to be. Let's say the brick is like. 10 pixels wide. Uh, so you want it to be able to start uh, yes. from position 10 to uh, position 100, or I guess not 100, be 100 minus 10, so like 90. Uh -huh. And that can be its X location. Its Y location can be from the top of the screen, which is 41, uh, random yeah. 41, so I guess 40, I'm just going to round it to 40, to 400. So those are the, that's the range for this left hand tower, and then the size can be like 10, 5. Oh. So Wait. this line right uh -huh. here, this line of code, uh -huh. the size is 10 five. That's the size of your bricks. I can change it to make them look different. I can make it like 50 instead of five and then it looks totally wrong. Uh -huh. <laughs> this is the important part, the random. So I'm just making a for so loop that loops the number of times the number of bricks you want to appear. Uh -huh. And I, this is the X number, the range for the X number. Uh, it can be from position 10 because of position up to 90, because if it starts at position 100, it'll be like extending. Oh, into the castle. for the X position. All right. Now I get it. Yes. I thought it's like normal this coordinates, like X, Y, X, Y, not X, yeah, X, Y. No, no this right, is X, Y with height. This is the X position. This is the Y position. The width yeah, I get it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. So you can right, change thanks. it to the other side, you can increase the number, <laughs> might not look too good, yeah. uh, but you can always like adjust this to be like, if, if there's already a stone there, don't put it there or something, you know? And by the way, if you refresh the canvas, will it like put them on, like, will they change their yeah. position? Yes. Yes. Nice, all right. What you could also right, do, great. this is more complicated, yeah. you could say, uh -huh. um... You could be like, 
you know, this might not even be worth mentioning. I was thinking of breaking them up into blocks. Like have I go down by 20 every time or by 10 and say like, there's a random chance you put a block here. There's a random chance you put a block here. There's a random chance you put a yes, block here. Yes, that's like what I wanted because it seems like they're kind of floppy. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start at position um, 40. Mm -hmm. So I is 40. It's going to go all the way down to the bottom of the screen. So it's going to be down to 400. <laughs> this looks good. Don't worry. Anyways. Plus equals 40. So it's going to go equals. down by right, 40 every, every time. So plus equals just means increase it by 40. Oh. So I can do plus equals one, and it means the same thing as plus plus. Oh, all right. Yeah, all right. I plus equals 40 means like it's zero. Oh, it starts at 40, and then it goes up by 40. Yeah. Now it's 80. I'm actually going to change this. I meant to say 10, but like I said, I'm stupid. Uh, so yeah, it's going to go down every 10. And then I'm going to have uh, another if statement. Or just not another action, but like an if statement. It's going to say, it's going to generate a random number. Yeah. Um, from 1 to 10. 0 to 10. Ah, 1 to 10. 1 to 10 is good. 1 to 10. If that randomly generated number is greater than like 2, there's an 80% chance that a brick is going to spawn. If it's greater than 7, it's going to be an 80% or a 70% chance. All right. You could also make it be e less than, to, you know. Yeah. So I've given it a 70% chance for a rectangle to spawn. Uh, so if that random number is within the 70%, then we'll we'll put it in a, a random position for the x value, and then but then vertically, it'll be just it'll be i. So the first one will be a position 40, then 50, then 60, then 70, then 80, then 90, then 100, then 110, and they'll go down like this. Uh, yeah. If you want to make there be fewer stones, you can decrease the probability that one will spawn. Yeah. If you want to have more stones. Blood. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that, so huh. this is just the random chance that one will spawn. And then you can increase the number of bricks on each row by just making there be more rectangles. Oh, okay. wow. That's a lot of rectangles. <laughs> yeah, that's, I like yeah. the one. All right. Cute. <laughs> uh, yeah, but yeah, well, you do you. Great. All right. Or you could put like another for loop in here if you want to get more complicated and custom and whatnot. But uh, here, I'll just leave that in your code, and then yes. it'll be up to you to repeat that and customize it for the rest of your code. All right, that's great. This Thanks. this angle might be tricky. For example. That that would be a bit tricky. Yeah. It's um, all right. I'll just play around with it. <laughs> Awesome. Anyone right, else thanks. have a question? How old are you? Oh, me. 21. Oh, team. Uh, I'm oh, 13. <laughs> uh, whoever said they had a question, tell me your question. I need help with something. Can you show me? Um, should I share? Oh, okay. Yeah, go for it. So, for um, my creative motion blur, when you start with an expert on this one. one. But yeah. when I made it, like, it's so thin and, like, it disappears in it's seconds. It's because of all. it's the stroke weight. The stroke weight. Do I have to, like, change this to stroke weight? Yeah. No. Oh. No. That looks cool, though. Just keep that huh? a stroke and then add a stroke yeah, weight. Yeah, add a stroke weight. Oh, boom. We watched the buses bring the University. Uh, uh, and then to get it to show up more, go to line three and put a comma after 255. What oh. are the challenges? Line, line three, not line four. four. Line three, sorry. What are get the rid challenges? of that comma. Oh, I right. don't know. Can you Miles, what challenge? are the challenges? You can also open up your own project and look at the challenges. Yeah, but it doesn't show up. Five. And make, they should. Leo? Challenges are there. And then I should make don't, don't just be loud for the sake of being loud. Yeah, exactly. Um, the. <laughs> yeah, if you keep doing that, you're going to have to leave. I, I want you to be able to participate in a way that's not distracting to other people, and I want other people to be able to participate in a way that's not distracting to you. Everybody plays by the same rules. I can't hear one. All right. Um, yeah, so, so weird. 
<laughs> if you don't want it to flash, don't give it a random number in the middle or in the stroke or in the background. Random, right. Yeah, but random like, and... Oh, okay. If you want it to be a new random color every time you refresh, you can right. declare the variable at the top of the screen. I can't hear you. Yeah. Uh, you can't hear? Can everyone else hear me? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, Yes. I'm sorry that you can't hear. No, she I'm meant sorry. that she meant to put the stroke and stroke weight at the top of the screen. No, I meant to make a variable called color or background or stroke or something that you can actually use this on a reserved word and then set that to a random number. Oh. It's like var uh, nice. bright or var x or var color with a u <laughs> equals no. and then copy paste what you have for stroke except uh, put color in the front instead of stroke. Like, so make uh, it put all those random numbers gosh. into a color function. So var x equals color with no me? u. I can hear you. And then I just use stroke x. And, yeah, you don't use the word stroke. Just, oh yeah, 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 you're right. You put x in as the value in stroke, right. copy the random, put them in color. Because that way, every time the program's refreshed, it will choose a new color, but not every time it's called in draw. You may unmute yourselves, everyone. I was doing noise control. Okay. Bar X color, what's its issue? You need a close bracket before the semicolon. I know you already have one, but like, can, you need another can, one. Can, can we do a quiz? Right. Yeah, what, what quiz do you guys want to do? Yours. Okay. Uh, anyone just, have any other questions before we do a quiz? It still doesn't work, kind of. De decrease the amount oh. of transparency. So it should be like 10. 10. Okay, here again. okay I um, think I'll have to change this. I need, I need help oh, with NASA's project. Um, Wait, I'm to... doing the showcase. You may have to take that up with Miles. That I need um, help with. You're doing a I'll showcase you need help with. What showcase? What is Challenge 3? Um, It's for uh, like H HSB something for the background. I was making it HSB. So you know the house can, uh, showcase can you that show, you were doing? Can you... One oh, sec, one question at a time. Um, my, Miley, were you asking a question? No, I, okay. I was just asking if you could do a lesson on HDSB. Um, I will have to research it HSB. over the weekend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll have to research it, and then I'll get back to you. But I will. Um, who HSB else had a question? HSB stands for Hue, Saturation, Brightness. I know, but, like, how to use it. Like, like I tried using it, but it was we all We use black. it in Slitter.io for the rainbow skin. U is what color the rainbow it is. Saturation is how gray it is, and brightness is the brightness. Um, who? Okay, so somebody had problems with a, a showcase. Oh, Al, you should take out one of the oh, randoms. Sorry. sorry, Al, take out one of the randoms. Who who is having trouble with their showcase? Me. Okay. Uh, can you say your username so I can look you up? Alicia A. Alicia G -E -E okay, thank you. So I was. Whoa, who's who am I looking up? Alicia. Alicia. Lisa G E E T H A. Um, Alicia, what's your last name? Oh, G Gita. Yeah, it's Gita. G E E T H A. Okay, gotcha. Like I said, I'm stupid. Um. All right. Showcase. Showcase. Showcase is seven. Whoa, good for you. It's Which called one? My House. My House. Beauty. I love it. What would you like help with? Oh, so, I just clicked. So the, show, the showcase that you were doing, the one with the different rooms, I wanted yeah. to do something like that. But when I, I put the function, like when I click the mouse, the screen should change. But for some reason, it doesn't work. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you. What's up, Ethan? The window's red. Yeah, it's okay. Uh, room. I have an idea. Zero. So I'm saying if room is zero, I'm making this control variable up here. 
This is going to control what room the, the draw Java function is displaying. The Java house. Yeah. So if it's room zero, then we're going to call draw house, right. which it is. Else if room equals one, then we're going to draw room one. Okay. And then when we click the mouse, instead of calling the draw room one function, we're just going to increase room. So when I click, uh, nothing happens. I don't know why that is. Maybe that, room. Maybe that picture's not valid. Or like, don't no, call if it. Was, don't if it call wasn't, draw, oh. Don't, yeah. Hmm, it's not don't, working. Don't, don't call draw house a draw room. It asks you that the rhythm you have to use that you want to use. No, because no, I not. took this image from online, so. Yeah, so it should be fine. No, but for the uh, picture, it's, it's a zero call 400. No, it's okay with two parameters or three parameters. I always use four parameters. Yeah, because for me, it doesn't size. work for two parameters. Yeah, try adding a size. Hi, Dad. Yeah. Yeah, it's Dad, still not Dad? changing. The mouse click. Maybe you put a if statement in the mouse click function for the door. It should be fine. It should because it should just increase the room number. If our room equals zero, if room is zero, else if room equals one, draw room one. Maybe so the draw that, function it should be fine. Maybe that picture is not valid. Oh, okay, I'm gonna just get rid of this for a second and just draw room one. Oh, yeah, so yeah. it should be doing. So what's up in draw room one? It's a picture, and there's a background up here. Yeah, so the picture isn't happy. Um, I'm going to paste my code back in here. Let's follow this image link, see where it leads us. Let's see your beautiful Oh, that's lovely. No, why should I mute myself? Uh, there we go. It should be working. Var picture equals load image, blah, 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 semicolon. Background image pictures. Bam! Oh my goodness. Don't be loud, please. Uh, yeah, we can do You know what? I'll put this on my list of things to look at. Good luck. I'm going to start a, a quiz now for people who want one. Can you be a commenter? Yeah, I can read who's winning and whatever. What quiz do you guys want to do? Welcome to Hatch. Are we supposed to do Miley's? It's okay. We can do this she, one today. She, she doesn't want to do it right oh, now. Okay. No, no someone else wanted to do yours, so we can do yours today. Oh, okay. So Wait, so the rest of the day is just going to be quizzes? Yeah, because there's only 15 minutes left. Too. Okay, yeah, bye, probably. everybody. Bye. Bye, bye. bye. Terminology. Can we do terminology? Launch oh, yeah, yeah, launch day. Terminology. Oh, it's a dumb quiz. Oh, actually, uh, can you can you switch my vote to Gotham's? I cannot, unfortunately, but I can remember that there's one more vote on Gotham's. It I seems like, you know, what's your question? Why are there no webinars in the, I mean, this meeting, because it's not a webinar anymore. Why, why this meeting is not on the weekends? Uh, because I like to have weekends that I can rest and not work. You know how you guys like to have, when you're in school, you like to have the weekends where you're not teaching, or you're not teaching, you're not learning. Teachers yeah. also like to have days where they're not teaching. <laughs> that's, not, that, that's not true. You still Dude, work. Dude, pros for each side. Yeah. Yeah, well, teaching is problem. unbelievably hard. Do you, <laughs> Gotham, do you remember when you led the class? Don't remind Teach. me of that moment. Also, teaching right? is, teaching is, easy for me, but it makes it feel harder when you're teaching a three-year-old person. <laughs> they that's, just don't listen. So that's absolutely true. Imagine that you're you're teaching people who are a third of your own age. Who, who here is like seven or eight? I'm 11. <laughs> I'm 10. Nine. I don't have good hearing. If, if you're 10 or 11, then you're half my age. I'm 11. And it's wow. very hard to teach Wait, a 30 year old. I'm 11. 
You're I 11. You're 11. You're 11. You're 11. You're 11. Is I'm it 15. Fun to have that? I'm 15. <laughs> what? I don't know. Who's 15? So we're, uh, we're doing Welcome to Hash. Who's 15? Can we do it in team? Miley. Miley. No, I'm okay, not 15. Okay, Miley's 15. not 15. Because I don't know your age. I'm not stalking you. <laughs> Here's the quiz. Uh, wait, no. That's to not, annoy that's Leo, I'm going to spam. I'm gonna say spam, bother him. I'm gonna copy everything he says. Four two seven one five one. Four two seven one five one. Four two seven one five one. Four, two, seven, one, five, one. Wait, nope. This is not what I mean to be posting. I'm sorry. I, you know, I think having back pain is kind of getting to me. But, but <laughs> what's this noise about? Is that why you're standing? This? Yeah, because it keeps my back muscles engaged and they don't lock up. What's What's this quiz about? Is basics. it terminology? It's basics. Is it terminology? It's basics. So that includes some terminology. Don't worry on the British bunnies. Please draft me to the British bunnies. Please, please draft me to the British bunnies at the right okay, time. Okay, so who, what's your username? Andrew, live. Okay, when Andrew joins the game, I'll switch you over. <laughs> Four, two, seven, one, five, one. Four, two, seven, one, five, one. Ah, yeah. I'm going to start the game right now. And British bunnies. There's no hurdling turtles. I'm British Buddies too. Who's British? <laughs> Who is this? I'm a Leo potato and a Can I be drafted to um, um, morning owls? Wait, uh, no, there's morning. no hurdling turtles. Whoa. Whoa. Wait, wait. Who wants to be in the morning owls? No, Say someone, your username. Wanted to, someone wanted to go from the morning owls. Okay, tell me your username British and where you want to go. I want to I, I wanna go to British Buddies for um, ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha, this one? British Buddies? Yes. Um, um, there. Oh, okay. I go wanna, to British Bunnies? I want to be served. Sir, I'm served to fill. I want to stay on British Buddies. Wait, is Miley? Ah, ha 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 ha. Okay, no, I'm go to British ha, ha, ha. Bunnies. There, I'm starting now. Wait, but it's not done. Just start, just start. Right. Just start. It no, doesn't matter, guys. Oof. Wait, which one are we doing? Well, you'll see, I guess. What's oh, going to hatch? Oh my god, my speed is coding. Yeah, yeah, it's about coding. <laughs> what? Is this a coding class? Can you do commentary? Who told me? Yeah, Vegan Sharks is winning. Even though, because because they only have three members. No, that's not true. Well, yeah, they're also doing well, but like they get more points. Remember, if they have three players and British Bunnies has five, congratulations, you played yourself. But everybody wanting to be in British Bunnies is gonna be harder for you to win. You're Actually, also, it's not true. The higher the streak, the more points you get. Otherwise, it's the same for everybody. Okay, well there you go. So everybody gets streaks. Beacon Sharks is still in first, Brave Chickens is in second, Morning Owls just overtook first place, followed by Beacon Sharks, Brave Chickens, and Brutish Bunnies is last. Brave Chickens is now in second place, Morning Owls is the winner, uh, Beacon Sharks is now in last, Brutish Bunnies passed up to third place, Brave Chickens and Morning Owls are viciously fighting for first place, Morning Owls is holding it on uh, for now, Brutish Bunnies is once again in last, with Beacon Sharks in third place, and Brave Chickens in second and Morning Owls maintained their spot, though so there was a brief blip where they switched around. British Bunnies is in last, Vegan Sharks is in second, Brave Chickens is in third. Uh, Brave Chickens now in second place, followed by Vegan Sharks and British Bunnies. Morning Owls holding the lead. Uh, and yeah, stand oh, Vegan Sharks snagged first place. Morning Owls is still second though, British Bunnies still last, leaving Brave Chickens in third. Morning Owls have reclaimed their place in first. What the? Brave I'm going to activate power play in three, two, one. Brave chickens and vegan sharks have been switching back and forth between second and third place, but brave chickens is in second for now. Brave chickens has passed morning owls into first place. Morning owls in second, vegan sharks in third. Morning owls and everyone's shuffling. Vegan sharks in first now. Now brave chickens is in first. Vegan sharks second. Morning owls third. British bunny still in last. Vegan Sharks and Brave Chickens switching back and forth for first. Morning Owls is now in third. 
vegan sharks in first, brave chickens in first, uh, morning oh. owls in third, morning owls jumped up to second, vegan sharks in third, brave chickens in I, first, I vegan sharks are playing second, British bunnies are still last. I should have never been third. on the British bunnies. <laughs> yeah, unless everybody wanted to be on British Bunny, so I'm like, okay, you guys can have the most players. Brave Chickens is winning. Well, I got one wrong. <laughs> I'm in a streak oh, no, of the key. Good power up. <laughs> oh, yes, time two. Any time two. Brave Chickens still holding first, Vegan Sharks in second, Morning Owls in third, and Brutish Bunnies in oh, last. Oh, actually, at the end of this code, I, I don't. <laughs> X equals zero. Streak of 17. Streak of 18. I had a streak of 18, but then I lost it. I've been silent because everyone's holding their positions. This oh, is a no. tense game. Everybody's like, doing nothing. I have decided that my water bottle is now my microphone. You guys haven't heard this voice from me before, have you? I, have. I am an announcer. Blah, blah, blah. Still the last voice. Justin, British buddies are still in last place and they are not happy about it. What the? Why am I? Oh, is not working. Why? I, was, I could have used my times too th this mm -hmm. time. Oh, A yeah. fatal error from British Bunny. Oh, is this Al? So? Oh. Al has finished with a streak of 19. Congratulations, Al. Vegan Shark steals first place. definition. Oh. Whoa, 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 we're loud today. Brave chickens regained their place in first. Vegan Come sharks on. second, morning owls third, British bunnies still in last place. Come Can on. I enjoy the British bunnies? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, Miley's on British bunnies. I'm not. Well, I'm in brave chickens. <laughs> and uh, brave cool. chickens is winning. Uh, there's I'm, in vegan. I, I'm in vegan yeah. sharks. Yay. Okay, well, I used to be in the vegan shark, but I got moved to British bunnies. Is it? I need a 50-50. 80% class accuracy, that's awesome. Yeah. Oh, that's good. Regardless of who wins, I'm proud of you all for getting that 83% collectively. Does, does, does any of you British bunnies have a times two? Or double yeah. jump? You know what's funny? Yeah. When we announce to a quiz for fun, we always get 100% class accuracy. That's not funny, that's just oh. true. Oh. <laughs> How is that funny? Good for you. It's good. It happens every time, that's why. Yeah, it, that just means that you know how to do coding. <laughs> I, uh, come on, I need a, I need a time to a double jeopardy. Oh, time freeze. Why do I need a time freeze? To oh, face I'm getting full coding. Yeah, there is like a lot of noise. Which of these lines of... Rip oh, headphone well, users. I'm a headphone well. user. <laughs> oh, noise. <laughs> almost done. Uh, Brave Chickens is first, Vegan Sharks is second, Morning Owls in third, British Bunnies finishing oh, no. up in the last place. I don't British Bunnies have a chance to catch up. Where is this yeah, it's true. MJ Screaming nice. Potato. Nice. Oh, right. Well, Vegan Shark was so close to catching up to Brave Chickens. Vegan Sharks. <laughs> Sorry, oh, oh, redemption question! Yes, I have a redemption question. Congratulations! Congratulations for getting a redemption question. Now, don't mess it up. I didn't mess. It. Good. I think, I think it's done. Um, yeah. yeah I think Come it's on! Done. How good? How good did the other people, do? The other teams do? Wah, wah, yeah, wah. Second. I I might have Third got this morning out. Second How is vegan it? sharks versus brave chickens. Congratulations. No, screaming potatoes. Get them. Come on. Screaming hi, potato. hi, hi. All right, there we go. Uh, who else? Do you want to review the questions? You got 83% for that. No. Um, hey, can I see? Uh, can this is my class accuracy? My, the, my, the oh, I already navigated away from it. Um, Gotham, you got 100%. You yeah, yeah. <laughs> cheated. Well, who did, what quiz do you want to do now? Um, uh, is it the hardest welcome, one you have? Welcome to Hatch. We OG. Uh, this is, we just did Welcome to Hatch. Can you do the hardest one? The hardest quiz yeah, you have? Yeah, one. Oh, I don't want to. Do, do another Wait. team one. But next time you should. Wait, are we doing uh, another quiz or? Yeah, I'll make it a team quiz because it's the hard one. <laughs> May you draft me to the hurdling turtle? Yes, Leo. We are doing a quiz. I mean, uh. Yeah, I'll put you in hurdling yeah. turtles, Andrew. Andrew. I will put you in hurdling turtles if there is a hurdling turtles. 
Does that work? Yeah. Yeah. Is that cool with you? Oh, oh I've been hurling turtles. There is no hurling turtles this time. Never mind. I thought it was. There's no hurling turtles. This Correct. Uh, I don't want to be on British bunnies again, but I guess I want to be on tiny whales. Uh, no if you want owls. me to change you over, let me know your username and the team you want. Oh, I and think Buddies. Is British Buddies going to win this time? All the teams are balanced this time. So you cannot just switch until now. You know what's just me? Yeah, I know who you are. Owls is Gotham, isn't it? Oh, you got to be the morning owl! You got to be the morning owl! Can you guys, like, not yell? If you want to request something, you can, like, say it in, like, a normal person voice. And right. I'll be happy to assist you. Can I be in oh, Tiny Whale? Can Wales? I be in Tiny Whale? No, don't. No, I think I know which team's going to win. I Do people want to be in Tiny Whales? What are your usernames? I have, I have, Gotham I have Gotham a Gotham Warren. Really? Uh, I have a dot me Roblox. Yeah. I want to go to Tiny Whales. Yeah, we got them. Can you go, go, whatever oh, my name is? Oh. Can buddies? you make the teams equal? <laughs> yep. Now it's equal. Okay. Wait, okay. may I I'm be on Tiny now. Whales, please? May, may I be on oh, Tiny Whales? We better not I'm move. sorry I already started the game because four, we only have four three, minutes left. Two, uh, one. fair warning, Can this is a really hard one. How many equal levels? sides are you to the definition? Audio. An audio option. So yeah, this one is really hard, so don't Can you bad. say who's winning and stuff? Uh, sure. We only have four minutes left, just for the record. Morning Owls is currently winning. Brutish Bunnies just overtook them. Tiny Wells is in second, or in third, and Woke Sloss is in fourth. Who's winning? Uh, Woke, Woke Sloss has not got a question right so far. Brutish Bunnies is now winning. Tiny Wells is in second, Morning Owls is in third, and Woke Sloss is still in last. Still without a question right, but it's okay, because this is a hard quiz. Somebody asked for the hardest one I had, so. <laughs> I loaded up this one. Because the previous one was the easiest one I have. So, it's fair. <laughs> British Bunny's still winning. Morning Owls in second. See, Tiny I Wales told is you, British Bunny's a good team. <laughs> Tiny Wales is now in fourth place. Uh, or sorry, who, third, second, second, second place. It goes British Bunny, is, Tiny Wales, Morning Owls, Wolf Who is on British Bunny's? Uh, if someone's in British Bunny's, please speak now or forever hold your peace. British Bunnies is still in first place, by the way, followed by Tiny Whales, Wilkes Lost, Morning Owls, and last. Uh, where's my phone? I had a phone at some point. A phone once did exist in my possession. <laughs> okay, I found Who it. Who is British Bunny? The phone has decided to run away and start its own life. <laughs> True. No, I found it. It's fine. Who is in British Bunnies? Because they're winning by a lot. I don't know. I don't know. I can't see. I go see questions. Uh, what would you text? Oh, yeah, this one's a hard one. 38% accuracy, 37. This is why it's a good class, a good bracket A for the, for the winners. <laughs> uh, Brutish Bunny's still in first, followed by Woke Sloth, Tiny Wells, Morning Owls. All right, I gotta go now for to my okay. group project with Veronica and the others. Bye, bye, bye. Have fun. All right, bye, bye. I'm gonna end the webinar soon anyway. I'm sitting down now. Because I've been standing for a couple hours and it hurts. <laughs> well, Veronica's also my coach, also. Great. Do you like having Veronica as a coach? She's telling me to make two. She's telling me to do three thousand challenge points. Ah, oh, it's because she knows you're smart. No, I only got nine thousand challenge points last week, but she wants me to do two thousand. I, I don't because I don't know why she wants me to do too much. I just got to level six it's because. Students tend to match the expectations you have of them. Like, oh. if you have high expectations, then the students could perform well. If you have low expectations, why would anyone want to perform higher than expectations? If I'm like, if, if I know that somebody's really smart and can do more than they're doing, I will push them to do that. If they don't achieve it, well, that's on me because I expected too much of them, but then they usually do because they're smart and they don't realize it. That's how students are. Anyway. Uh, I gotta go. Believe in themselves. Can you just can believe in yourself? Can, can, can you just end it and see who's had? The I'm not gonna that? do that. I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna end the webinar, but you can finish out the game. Thanks. Uh, <laughs> bye, guys. I'll see you on Monday. Bye.